Hi, this is Tim from Nova Backup, and today I'd like to show you how to set up your Nova Backup client to backup to an S3 cloud. This video applies to all versions of Nova Backup 19.8 or greater, and will work with any generic S3 provider such as Backblaze, Wasabi, or Amazon. Before you get started, you will need some information, namely your access key, your secret access key, and the bucket you will want to store your data in. You will also need your username and backup directory, both of which are used to organize your data within the S3 compatible storage bucket and facilitates having multiple machines backing up to the same bucket. I will be using Wasabi for our example today, but the same process applies to other S3 providers as well. Once you have all of the required information, open your Nova Backup client and go to the Device tab. Click on the Add button at the bottom of the screen and select Generic S3 Storage Services. This brings up your generic S3 storage properties and is where you will input the information you gathered earlier. You will need to make sure to fill in every field in order for this to work. For backup directory, you can enter a pre-existing directory in your bucket or you can create a new bucket on the fly. Also, Keep in mind that everything on this screen can be edited later, except for the device name itself. Once everything is entered in, hit Check Credentials to test the connection, and you are ready to run a backup job. One thing I should mention, though, is that the Delete tab will not work with S3 Storage. If you need to delete any previously backed up files, you will have to do it manually through your S3 provider's web portal. I hope you found this video useful and informative. If so, please consider giving us a thumbs up and hitting the subscribe button to see more content. If you would like to learn more about S3 configuration and some of the options available to you, please consult our knowledge base article that is linked in the description below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.